Hey guys, we're here live in Marpaw today, and this is Buck and Lisa. These are some homeowners out here. Kimberly, if you can get a span of what's going on around us. Uh, we're in day 53 of the storm here, guys, and this house has had zero attention. We've had calls to FEMA. Uh, we've, we've reached out, and the Cajun Army is here today, so we're excited that we're getting to muck out this house. And we just want to create awareness. We are asking for help, guys. We desperately need help. This is one house in an area where 75 to 90 percent of the homeowners have lost everything. And 53 days into this thing, there's still no attention. So uh, we just want to walk you through the house real quick, show you a little bit of what's going on, and really ask you to search your heart and figure out how you can be a part of this work that so desperately needs to get done. I just want to ask you guys how how's it been walking through this what are where are you guys at right now it's just rough i mean i just can't explain it it's just too rough very very hard it, fema's not wanting to help us at all thank god for y'all because we haven't gotten anything done since august when this happened where are y'all living right now in the camper we just got that a couple days ago somebody loaned it to us because mm -hmm. we were living all the way in Marrero which is like an hour and a half two hour ride away yeah. to come home every couple and days we couldn't get nothing done you know we're doing that ride with my back and all yeah. it's just rough. Buck has had a couple of back surgeries he was in a bad car accident guys this is real this is what we're dealing with and we're just asking you to please help I don't care where you're at if you're in Tennessee if you're in West Virginia if you're right here in Baton Rouge area we just ask you to please help these people they desperately need it please go to the www.thecajunarmy.com and figure out how you can help not if but how we're gonna walk you through the house real quick just to show you a little bit of what's going on Better poke towels and I'm gonna throw that away, huh? Well. If you notice, right behind this, right behind us here, that's black mold on the walls, guys. It's very dangerous. This house hasn't been touched in 53 days, so today we're mucking it out. And once again. I'm just asking you to come and help us, please. We need your help. These people need your help. Thank you. Thank you. 